Sharks are on cocaine. A study just came out that shows very high concentrations of cocaine in sharp nose sharks in Brazil. Researchers tested 13 different sharp nose sharks, this species here, and all 13 of them came back with high levels of cocaine in their system. And not just like a little tiny bit, they actually showed that the levels of the cocaine found in these sharks were reported to be as much as 100 times higher than in previously observed marine species. And this is the first study to actually analyze cocaine in sharks. There's been other studies done on species like mollusks, uh, crustaceans, eels, other smaller species like that. And with that higher concentration that is found in the shark specifically, it's indicating a chronic exposure to the drug. And people are wondering, how are sharks getting cocaine? No, they are not just getting their hands on it, getting their fins on it and snorting it. It basically is getting in the ocean from dumping, so it could be traffickers um, accidentally losing packages or dropping them in intentionally to hide them. But not only that type of dumping, when we as humans ingest cocaine and then go to the bathroom, your urine, feces, all of that has cocaine in it still when you're excreting those things. And so that's definitely a really big way all of this could be getting in the ocean. And of course, cocaine sounds like exciting and interesting to people, but um, you know, it's so many other different things that are also running off into the ocean, things like antibiotics, antidepressants, all their pharmaceutical drugs, sunscreen, insecticides, fertilizers, all of these different things are entering the water every day from our skin when we shower and from when we go to the bathroom when they make their way through our system. So if cocaine is present in these sharks, it's really likely that all of these other types of drugs and substances are as well. And there isn't any understanding on how the levels of a cocaine could be affecting the shark's behavior or even changing anything like that, which would definitely be something interesting to look at. Um, but a really big concern is that, especially the species, the sharp nose, the one that they tested in Brazil, is a species that a lot of people eat. And they are ingesting these high concentrations of cocaine, other substances as well. So what do you guys think? Do you think that uh, sharks ingesting or being around cocaine and basically in the environment could affect their behavior do you think it's just like crazy what are your thoughts on all of this